and there through the trees is Ashby Canal Centre. It's quite a smart bridge. I think you can see how low the water is. That boat appears to be grounded. Unfortunately, very busy back there at Cheney Wharf. Uh, we needed to get rid of some rubbish, but we couldn't moor up. There was boats everywhere. And of course, it's the Battle of Bosworth, which is over here. Um, and we'd have liked to meet, uh, to uh, had a walk up there and have a look. But perhaps on the way back, um, it was far too busy. Very, very busy. <laughs> but uh, yeah, there's always another day. Well, we've been cruising a lot longer than we wanted to. Uh, we've had several attempts at mooring up and we keep grounding out due to the low water levels. So uh, we're carrying on, but it's getting very hot and we're getting very tired. <laughs> we will find mooring, I'm sure, but all the boats that are moored up, they basically look grounded themselves. At last, we found mooring. <laughs> We're moored up just through Bridge 37 here. Um, nice mooring. Um, oh, Daily Whaley come to join me. I wonder what that was there for a minute. There he is, having a wee. Um, so, yeah, we're going to stay here for a couple of nights, actually. I've got Dale. Come here. Come on. I've got Forgo narrowboating uh, tomorrow night, and it seems like I've got a good Wi-Fi here. I'm also going to have a day off from filming tomorrow. Um, so yeah, this will do us. We're having a barbecue this evening and as I said earlier on, we might be meeting someone here tomorrow afternoon. So uh, looking forward to that. But this will do us uh, for today. Um, a longer cruise than we thought today uh, due to the silt and low water. Lots of grounded boats and a lot of people struggling to be fair. Not the best, but it can't be helped. But I believe there's rain coming in for next weekend. So that might bring the water levels up. Right. Once again. I'm going to go and sit with my friends. I'll catch you later. Hiya. Daily Whaley. Hello. Now, what's this? Good morning. It's Wednesday, the 21st of July. Does anyone recognise that boat? Yes, my mate Malcolm has turned up. Malcolm and Hillary have been on their own adventure. They've been all over the place and they turned up yesterday afternoon. So uh, we had a bit of a party, let's just say. So we're all a little bit late to getting up this morning. Uh, we had a cracking barbecue. It was just brilliant. We had uh, Forgo narrowboating as well with Mark and Debbie. I'll leave the link uh, below if you want to have a look at that. 
but we had all we all had a great night last night uh, but this morning we're cruising up to Bosworth Marina we've got full loose and full bin bags we've got to get rid of the rubbish and an empty water tank so uh, we all need to fill up with water so that's where we're headed initially as for the mooring for tonight I've no idea uh, but it's good to see me old mate Malcolm back it's really good Well, that's it. We're on our way. You can see Hillary's boat there and Malcolm is across the canal. Good old Malcolm. True to form. Yes, we're heading up to Bosworth Marina. Uh, we do need the facilities there. We need to get some shopping as well and apparently there's a bus service every hour uh, by the marina that takes you straight into Market Bosworth. So we're going to go and have a bit of an explore there. So uh, yeah, it'd be nice. I like to see these new towns. And it's a little bit cooler this morning as well, so that'll make it easier for the dogs. It's a good day. Um, had a nice rest from filming yesterday. Um, that's only two days that I've had off that I haven't filmed, so uh, that was nice as well. Feel like I'm recharged and ready to go. Good morning. One thing that's very, very noticeable on this canal, a lot of times when you go under a bridge, there's a remembrance bench. Somebody's put a bench there in, rem rem in memory of a loved one. Uh, but there's a lot of them on this canal, I've noticed that. Yeah, loads. Well, we're just coming to a water point, so we're gonna get water here as it's free. And then go in the marina to empty the loo and get rid of the rubbish. Well, we're just at the water point here by Bosworth Marina and I bumped into Pete and Ali and the beautiful dog Ziga from uh, Narrowboat Soulmates. Uh, if you look at their channel, more to explore. I'll put a link in the description below, so take a look. So it's good to bump into these guys. Yeah. Right, see you folks. We'll definitely catch up with you. We will. See you later. See you, Ziga. Have a great day. You too, mate. Take care. Yeah, great to bump into them. Have a look at their channel. It's uh, it's a great channel and they are constant cruisers. Uh, good to meet them. Right, let's get into the marina. Once again, lovely marina, Bosworth Marina and lovely friendly staff so we've done our bit we're getting out again I've got to say, this canal is breathtaking. Absolutely beautiful. Well, we moored up just under bridge 47, 500 yards or 500 meters from the pub, the horse and jockey, which we're going to go and have a look at shortly. 
but we passed uh, Hillary and Malcolm. They were moored up further back here. Uh, so I'm going to go and show them where they can moor and meet in them. Yeah, we did pass some moorings, you see, and they want to come and join us. So uh, he just wanted me to go and stand by uh, where to moor up. And then we can all walk to the pub. It's literally a couple of minutes walk from the bridge from where we're moored. So there's plenty of room for two 50 foot boats here. That'll do us. Go past the second boat, Malcolm. Keep going. More up after the second boat. Oh, that's it. They're moored up. All safe and sound. I'm going back to Chugs now, get these boots off, get my sandals on, and then probably just go for a quick pint and then back to the boats and just chill out for the afternoon because it's getting very warm. <laughs> Beautiful. I do like this canal. Oh, hello, you two. Oh. Was it a warm night, Chipster, again? Oh, you're toasting. You are warm. Good morning. Morning. Oh. You daily whaley. You got your ear wrong. Boop. There we go. Hello. You don't want to know this morning, do you? Hey. It's okay. Oh, bless you. Well, good morning. Look at that sun. It's going to be another hot day today. Apparently the weather's going to peak. It's going to be really hot today. It's Thursday, the 22nd of July. Uh, it's about five to six in the morning. We're getting an early start today. Not yet, though. I'm having my coffee. Um, I think we're leaving about eight, half eight. Uh, we're going to go to the end of the Ashby Canal today. Well, as far as we can go anyway, we can only go so far as uh, Chugs and Estrella are both 57 foot and the winding hole at the end of the Ashby, which is navigable, uh, is 52. So just after bridge 61 or thereabouts, there's a winding hole. So we'll be turning around, but we may walk up to the end just to go and have a look. Um, and we've heard reports of a swing bridge. Uh, yeah, a swing bridge that uh, isn't working. It's faulty. So even if you are in a smaller boat, you still can't get up there, I believe. But we'll find out when we get up there. But uh, yeah, first, it's a coffee. Wow, it's going to be a hot day. Uh, Malcolm and Hillary are moored up just under that bridge. So they're demooring and they're going to go in front. Both of their boats are 50 foot. And John and I's boat, uh, John's boat and my boat, Chugs, is 57. They're 57 foot. So we can't make it to the end. So we're winding. So they're going to go through uh, the winding hole by bridge 61 and moor up and wait for us. We're going to wind and moor up and then jump on their boats just so we can say we did the end of the Ashby, uh, hopefully, uh, by narrow boat. So that's the plan. I better untie and get ready to go. And we just made a full 90 degree turn to the left and that brings you immediately to go over an aqueduct here that takes you over the river Sense. 
it's funny you know on this trip I've heard of rivers that I've never heard of before <laughs> These trees are offering a lovely welcome bit of shade uh, this morning. There's already some heat in that sun. It's going to be a very hot afternoon. But I think we've already seen where we're going to moor up back there. And I'll show you that soon. But uh, yeah, we're making good time. And this is just perfect. Perfect. 